Can you imagine that on our complexion? Like, oh my God. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Thanks so much for stopping by. My name is Tamara Renee. So as you can see by the title of today's video, you guys, the video is finally here. I'm sharing with y'all all the details of my entire wardrobe when I went on vacation to Jamaica. When I dropped these pictures on Instagram, you guys went crazy. You guys also went crazy in the comment section on the vlog, um, talking about the jewelry and everything. Like I even, I'm wearing some of it right now because why not? <laughs> and um, I honestly love how my entire wardrobe came together. Some of it was last minute, but I pulled through to make it work. And I am so glad that you guys like it as well. As always, I'm going to link everything down in the description box below. We're going to get into the details, sizing material, how I came across, you know, all the extra stuff. So if you're interested in knowing about my April outfits, vacation edition, then keep on watching. As always, I'll be looking at my phone for reference. So we're just gonna get right into it. Outfit number one, outfit number one. And I think I'm gonna go in the order of how I wore each fit while I was out there. So this is the first outfit. You guys loved it so, so, so much. And I absolutely love this outfit as well. So this is actually a two piece. It is from Fashion Nova. You guys, when I saw this two piece on Fashion Nova, I had to snag it so quick. Like I was getting notifications, letting me know that my size was running low. Um, I was battling between extra large or a large, but I ended up going with an extra large because it is like a crossover type of skirt and I'm very hippie and I didn't want to get the large where it would be too tight where the split would kind of like stretch a bit and I didn't want too much to be open, you know? So I went with the extra large. It is such of, it's made of such good material. It's like that slinky material. It's stretchy, it's thick. Um, the quality is there. You guys thought that this was a dress, but it's actually a two piece. This when I purchased it, like I said, I know it was running low in stock and I think it was completely out of stock, but the last time I checked, Fashion Nova did restock this entire look. So I'm gonna have the link below, but make sure to get your hands on this two piece. It is so beautiful and I love the style of it as well. I do know that Fashion Nova has another style to this same green look, but it's a long sleeve um, crop top. It's still nice, but me personally, me can't be with the long sleeve in a hot weather. Mm -mm. And right now it's super duper hot in the city right now like I'm super duper hot right now like cha. but yes um so I decided to go with gold accessories so the earrings that you guys see me wearing right now is the same exact earrings I wore with this fit now to be honest with you guys I don't even remember how I came across these earrings but I just came across these earrings they're from this brand I made sure to keep the um little tag here because this is what it comes on and you put this up close. This is the brand right here. Um, I don't know if you guys can see, but it's Yu Ming Jewelry. Um, I was on the website and this was like a couple months back because obviously I knew like I was going to Jamaica, so I was preparing in advance. And when I saw those earrings, I'm like, I'm definitely going to buy them. Um, this website has so many beautiful gold accessories. Majority of my accessories, not majority, but like the earrings and stuff is from this website. Um, but we're going to get into the jewelry as we go on. But I had to grab these earrings because they're so beautiful. They're so different. And I think I like it more with my hair up. Like it just just does something to me like oh my gosh like don't get me wrong it was it was a look I was serving with the long braids and by the way I love the braids like right now I'm missing the braids because they're just so convenient but this is the look um I had this beautiful cuff bangle that I got from Zara. I one thing I loved about it is like a hammered material and it does have like little crystals like different color little stones embedded into it like it just it's so cute and i had to get my hands on it and then i wore these cute gold heels from asos these ones i do not recommend because it's like a slingshot type of heel so um even though you can adjust the tightness of the strap that goes 
uh, um, above the heel. Um, there's no support in the front of the foot, like around your ankle, like the front part of your ankle. Does that make sense? The support, is, the strap is only at the back. There's no support with the strap in the front. So I had to be mindful of when I was walking. Um, I did feel, you know, the strap kind of come down sometimes or come off my foot sometimes, which didn't make any sense because I did adjust the strap to the whole of the tightness that I want it to be. But y'all, I just couldn't be bothered. And then I grabbed my cute little gold pouch. And honestly, y'all, this is the look. I absolutely love it. All right, y'all. So outfit number two is this other two piece that I also got from Fashion Nova. Um, this piece, I think it's so cute and it was so perfect for the occasion. Um, went on a catamaran and it was so much fun. Um, the breeze was blowing and I just thought that this would be perfect for um, that day. So this, I believe I did get in an extra large and I got it in an extra large because of the bottoms so it does zip in the back um i was a bit hesitant at first but i had to make sure to read the reviews um down below and one of the reviews said that she was a bit concerned because um she thought it was like an open type of skirt but the inside piece is like a bathing suit type of piece like a swimwear um panties bottoms you know so that's what's made on the inside of the skirt and then we have the nice skirt around and then the top so the top is actually giving like top material it's not not anything that you would jump in the water with. Um, I love the sleeves. I love the details of this two piece. It is just everything. And I love how I did the half up, half down style. I accessorized with white. I did put on my white Dior shades. Every time I wear these glasses, you guys always come for me, but these are Christian Dior sunglasses. I got them about two years ago and I love them so much. Um, I put on my white Dolce & Gabbana slides. And now for the accessories, I'm gonna throw in a picture that's a bit closer so you guys can see the details the earrings is also from that same website um, that i told you guys about um when i saw these i thought they were so cute and i'm like no i have to have to have to have to snag them and for the necklace it's from zara i got this earlier in the year i think it was like january february if you guys follow me on tiktok and i think i probably put the short video on my channel here as well but i did like an earring haul from zara and i did oh no the video is on my tiktok you don't have to go on my tiktok to see it but i have the matching earrings to the necklace and i kept the necklace because i'm like i'm waiting until like the summertime or for me to just go somewhere really nice to wear it because it's just so beautiful it is a statement piece you guys know how much i love zara their accessories their clothing i will not stop talking about zara and i won't stop shopping at zara like what Zara is that girl? Zara is that girl for me, okay? And now for the bangles, um, as you can see right now, I'm wearing three of them, but I have two styles. So I have the round one. And then this day I had on like the square bangle shape ones. And I just think they're so cute. And I was also wearing this ring. Now these accessories, I purchased them off of Etsy. I don't know how, I think I was just looking for like gold jewelry. And then um, I ended up coming across these nice gold bangles. And what I love about these bangles, these are not the typical, just like push your hand in and go. You have to unbuckle. It's like a snap type of closure, if that makes any sense. Um, I really and truly don't want to take this off. Oh, there we go. Cause it's, it was easy. So this is how it is. It's just a snap closure. Do you hear that? Oops. Just like that. Um, it's easy to put on and easy to take off. But when I saw these, I'm like, nah, these are different. Like these give me like Indian, Egyptian type of vibes along with the ring as well. Let me give you all a close up. There we go. I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. Like these, this type of jewelry, like this is different, you know? And I was so happy to incorporate it into my whole jewelry collection. But Etsy really did come through for me with these accessories. And yeah, so I'm definitely gonna be purchasing more of these bangles. And um, I know y'all love them, so they'll be linked below so you can get your hands on them as well. Okay guys, so this next outfit, I believe it happens to be, like I have, 
I loved all the fits I wore, but I have a top three. And this is number one for me on my top three list. And when I dropped this outfit on Instagram, you guys went insane, okay? Let me just pop the photo up here for you guys to see. I am so, so, so in love with this beautiful dress. Like this is just so gorgeous, you guys. It is so beautiful. It's so different. Like you don't come across these type of um, pieces every day. And for this trip, especially, I wanted it to be something different, like a different vibe altogether. And when I tell you that my vision came to life, my vision came to life. So this is like a kimono style dress. I found this on Etsy. I was just searching, looking for different style kimonos. And I did come across this one vendor that has these beautiful kimonos. And I saw this dress and um, I saw it in another style as well, like a different print, but this one really caught my eye because it's like the orange and the red and then the greens with the whites. It's giving like a nice gold undertone and I knew that this would look so good against my complexion. So I definitely, definitely, definitely had to grab it. So for the sizing, this is a one size fit all. I was a bit skeptical about it, but I'm like, we'll give it a try. Um, so if you're on the thicker side like me, um, you will fill this dress up and um, you will see the true beauty of it. But if you're smaller than me, more on the slimmer side, I don't think it would fall as nicely and I don't think you would see the true beauty because honestly, I just wish that these came in actual sizes instead of a one size fit all. Because when I first tried it on, when I received it, I'm just like, oh child, I don't think this is gonna work for me. But when I put it on in Jamaica, I think the environment, just being on the island itself, I guess gave me a whole different look I feel everything I don't know but when I put this on it was on like it was on and popping okay and now for the accessories so these gold earrings um, are from the website I told you all about you Ming I believe that's how you pronounce it these earrings are so beautiful and I'm just like I have to snag it like I just have to so that's what I'm wearing with this fit and then you see like a subtle body chain um this I purchased from Amazon it was a pack of about five different body chains and I found the perfect one in that five that would work with this I wanted something that would come you know in between the cleavage and run down and this was just perfect because this dress does have a deep plunge it's a deep v neckline as you can see and having that body chain was just everything and I love that it also comes around the neck as well so it gives it this type of different delicate type of feel different look like y'all like it was just everything um I'm not too sure sure if I have any pictures where you can see but these are the same bangles that I was wearing with this fit the round ones from Etsy and then I had on the gold heels and I will let y'all know that majority of my fits I think I did wear my gold heels if not I wore like a simple sandal when it comes to vacation and packing like y'all I am an over packer it is crazy so I tried to reduce this time and just to bring simple heels of you know, like basic colors that can be worn multiple times with all my outfits. So, I mean, you can't go wrong with some nice gold metallic heels. Like you honestly, like those barely there type of heels. The, these are from ASOS, the ones that I told y'all about. Um, I'm not really a fan of them because of the fit, but it's a beautiful gold sandal, but definitely check out um, Nine West. You can check out Zara, cause Zara has a beautiful one that I ended up getting my hands on, but it kind of hurts, but hey. And then these ones from ASOS. And then I had my gold pouch and then I had my hair up in a high bun. And y'all, this is how the look turned out. All right, so next outfit is this burgundy colored dress. This is from Fashion Nova. And you guys, when I first saw the dress, I was like, I don't know if I wanna get it. And like, I was legit thinking about the dress and the very next morning, I'm like, you know what? Let me throw this in my car and make the purchase because I did not wanna miss out on this dress. I loved how it looked on the model. Well. The picture that they used was of someone actually wearing it and I loved how it looked on her. So not necessarily the model, but I loved how it looked on that woman wearing it. So I'm just like, what? No, I have to get my hands on this dress as well. So this is like a cutout style type of dress. It's definitely different as you can listen, my, my tan was popping. Okay. My tan was 
popping. But I just love how this dress looks on me. Now, let me be honest with you guys. I am really, really, really and truly not a fan of red or burgundy, especially like on me when it comes to clothing. Like, I don't know what it is. I just don't lean towards that type of like color clothing. So on this site, I honestly don't remember if I saw the it in burgundy or if it was giving more of a mauve type of color but when i received it and i tried it on i'm like it's giving like a wine red i'm just like uh, i don't know but i was definitely going to bring it with me still and still wear it like regardless but it was just me being a bit hesitant with the color so let me zoom in for earrings you guys you guys can see the earrings um these earrings are also from this site here these are just so beautiful i love the flower type of detailing and then the gold drop underneath like it's just so beautiful the cuff i'm wearing is that it's still that big cuff that i got from zara and then i had on some nice gold rings you guys really can't see the rings but these rings i purchased from etsy i believe the bangles and those rings are from the same vendor i'm not too sure i honestly don't remember but i'll have them linked below and it does give the same type of style and vibe of the bangles and i just love it love it love it and of course i threw on my gold heels and i grabbed my cute gold pouch and y'all, I was off to dinner on the resort every single night and I was feeling myself, okay? Feeling myself. Okay guys, so this next outfit is this beautiful green dress. Now, if you remember the dress I wore when I went to Aruba last summer, I was wearing the purple to the green. Well, I had to get my hands on this beautiful green. This dress is from Shein. Um, I don't remember the size I got. It, I believe it's a large, if not an extra large. But this dress is just so beautiful. I love the style of it. It is so classy, so elegant, so ladylike, and I just love it, love it, love it. Um, they do come in different colors now. I'm so sad that they haven't come back with the purple. I mean, I already have the purple, but it's just like, what if someone else wants the purple? Because it's just so beautiful. But um, they have the green. Last time I checked, I think they had like a burgundy red. They have it in nude. They have it in a baby pink, a baby blue. I think they have it in white and black now. Um, and I'm so mad at myself. I don't know if they have it in this color right now, but I think the time when I did purchase the purple, I think they had it in like a yellow or an orange. Can you imagine that on our complexion? Like, oh my God. But anyway, the purple and green will do it for me for now. I did accessorize with gold accessories as always, of course. And the necklace, you guys, this necklace is a statement piece. Like she is so bold. She is so beautiful. When I saw this necklace on Zara, it was definitely giving me like Egyptian vibes. And with this type of necklace, you wanna make sure that your neck is bare. You don't want any type of clothing that have like a strap or anything. You wanna go for something strapless. And when I wore this dress, I'm like, this necklace is the night I'm going to wear this necklace. Like. It's just everything. It's so beautiful. My gold heels, my gold purse, um, the earrings. You guys can't really see the earrings, but these earrings are also from Zara. They're of like um, a baby face type of style earring that you just like put in your ear. <sighs> Yo, these earrings are so fire. The necklace is so fire. I put on my gold bangles and I had on the nice gold rings as well. If you guys watch the vlog and like see how I move with my hands and stuff, you guys will notice the bracelets and the rings a whole lot better and clearer in those clips. And yeah, y'all, like this is what I wore on my last night for dinner and I was so sad. So, so, so sad. But I really, really love how this entire look came together. This next outfit is giving like a swimsuit type of look. Um, this is what I wore when I went rafting and I'm wearing the kimono right now, but let me pop up the photo right here. Y'all, 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 like, this kimono is so beautiful. I found it on Etsy from that vendor that I told you guys about. Like, y'all, you guys don't understand. When I saw this kimono, I'm like, I have to get this kimono. I have to, have to, have to. And immediately I did see like water with it. I don't know if it's because of the blue tones that it has, but it is just so beautiful and so elegant. The sleeves are, you know, very exaggerated. So you do have to be careful 
when you know you're walking around or doing anything because they can get caught into like door handles that has happened to me a couple times but i mean it is what it is but you just have to be mindful of your surroundings um this is of a very 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 thin material um i can't talk about quality it is just a thin fabric um, when I was putting this on, I did notice that there were a few snags on it. And to be honest with you, I don't know how the snags happened. The only thing I can think of, it was probably the braids. I feel maybe the texture of the braids hitting against the soft, delicate fabric kind of like did some snagging. Like, I don't know, because I didn't do anything crazy for the snags to be there. Like, you know what I mean? But I mean, it is what it is. And I had to just get my hands on these. Like, yo, you guys don't understand. So the bathing suit that I wore with it is this simple one piece bathing suit that I got from Fashion Nova. All the bathing suits I wore are from Fashion Nova and that's where I usually get my bathing suits from. If not Fashion Nova, then sometimes Shein. You guys were obsessed with the with the swimsuit and I'm like, you guys can't even see the swimsuit properly, but you guys still loved it regardless. And I just love that, you know, I really, really like that. And now for the accessories. So the earrings, um, that same website I told you guys about, and then the cuff that I'm wearing, it's this beautiful, you know, cuff, I got it from Shein and I was just, you know, shocked when I received it. It looked very nice on the site, but when I received it and I was holding it, I'm just like, no, this is just way too beautiful. Y'all, when it comes to Shein, jewelry just know that this is like a one-time wear type of thing because it's not real gold you're paying you're paying dirt cheap for the jewelry for the accessories so most of the time you wear it once listen the gold is gonna rub off so when it comes to she and stuff you're gonna have to like keep buying 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 if you want to keep up with whatever it is that it is okay but y'all i'm here to switch it up and do different things and all so um i love this uh cuff I'm going to look to see how it looks because I do want to wear it. If not, I'll just buy another one because why not? But I really love the cuff. And then I did that beautiful blue eyeshadow look because even though I was going rafting, listen, it's a photo shoot over in my head. It's a photo shoot in my world. OK, so I had to make sure that I looked really, really good for these pictures. And listen, the looks came together. OK, they came together but also it just came it just crossed my mind before i forget let me insert another photo of wearing the same outfit it's the same day just in the morning time um i did wear my white dolce and gabbana slides and i had my nice marnie bag but you guys can see i had this nice belt around my waist i got the gold belt from zara and y'all i was so sad it broke that same morning i was so hurt but you can tell that it wasn't um glued or put together properly i mean as sad as i was um i'm glad i got a one two one two pick wearing it um but that is how i styled the entire look and then i got my photos on the raft so yeah just wanted to let y'all know that all right y'all so this next outfit is this beautiful multicolored dress that i got from shein unfortunately um this is no longer available i purchased this last summer to be exact and when i tell you guys i completely forgot about this dress i forgot about the dress um i had it with me i bought it because i was wearing it on my last trip last summer and like i said i left it in my suitcase completely forgot i had it and when I saw it, I'm just like, okay, well, you're coming to Jamaica with me. I'm going to wear you somehow, some way. Um, so yeah, this is the dress. I love it. It is so cute. I love the two, you know, long splits in the front. Um, did not want to wear heels. This was, I can't remember what evening, but this was like a chill evening for me. And I just wore my sandals. Um, I did accessorize. Now for the earrings, I don't have a close-up shot, but if you watch the vlog, you guys will see, but the earrings they're from Zara. And I believe that it was meant like as a set, you know, Zara be doing things like that sometimes. So the gold cuff, the gold hammered looking style cuff with the nice, you know, bedazzled, you know, jewels, colorful jewels on it. That is how these earrings look, but I didn't want to wear it as a set. I did want to separate. Sometimes I'll be wearing my jewelry, you know, as set. Sometimes I just separate them, but those are the earrings that I wore. And then again, the gold jewelry paired it up with my white Jacquemus handbag. And I just love how this look came together. This next outfit, you guys, I took these photos twice. Okay. So let's pop the pic on the screen. So the first time I wore this um, dress or this fit, 
Um, it w I ended up getting the pictures in the nighttime and I was so hurt because I was trying to beat the sun, but it was just too late. And then by the time I was ready to take photos, it started raining. So the sky was just pitch black and dark and heavy and it just made no sense. But I did have on this orange and white uh, floral type of style kimono. This is from Shein. I did have it with the white bathing suit, but because I already got the white bathing suit with this kimono, I decided to wear an orange bathing suit. The bathing suit, the one piece is from uh, Fashion Nova. So I put this together and I just love how this look turned out. Um, you guys, I don't know if you guys can see, but I do have this beautiful gold cuff bangle. Um, that gold cuff bracelet is from Shein. The earrings, child, I don't remember if it's from that website that I've been telling all about or if it's from Etsy. I don't remember which one, but I'm gonna have that linked below. And then I had on the rings, of course. And for this style, I guess this time, even though I did wear it with the white Dolce & Gabbana slides the first time, I just wanted a picture with my Gucci slides because I didn't take any pics of my Gucci slides. So I ended up wearing the Gucci slides with it, even though I know the white ones would have looked so much better. But I loved the look with the white bathing suit. And this, um, I'll see if I can just pop a photo up for you guys to see. But this is how it looked. And I mean, the time passed, not, nothing we can do, but I made it work and you guys liked it too. So that's all that matters. <laughs> okay, y'all. So the last fit that I have to share with you guys, I, I don't know, like, let me just pop the picture here on the screen because let me just pop it here. I told you guys earlier that I had a top three and the top three, I mean, if it's not obvious, it's all the pictures, the outfits that I had on a kimono. Um, it's this picture here, the kimono dress one and the one I wore river rafting. I don't know what it is about this one though. I think it's the colors. It's just something about this kimono that I can't put it into words like how I feel. I'm just in awe, honestly. I wish you guys could feel what I'm feeling, but there's something about this entire look that just tickles me on the inside. I don't know if it's the colors, like it is just everything. So this kimono, Etsy, this happens to be the first kimono that I saw that led me to the shop on Etsy that I ended up finding and I fell in love. Now you can definitely wear your kimonos open and wear something underneath, but me, I'm the kind of girl, you know, that likes to keep it closed and wear it as a dress style. So to keep it in place, I did um, put on this beautiful gold coin chain belt from Zara, put it tight enough so that the front part of the kimono wouldn't move and it was everything. Now, let me tell you something. The makeup, I did do the blue eyeshadow look, which by the way, a tutorial is coming out real soon. Um, I did the blue look because I wanted, I just wanted everything to pop. Like, I don't, I don't know, I just wanted it to pop. The earrings, these are from the same website I told you guys about with the earrings. And by the way, I, I don't think I mentioned this, but out of all the earrings, this is the heaviest one. Now there is a bit of like tug that I can feel, nothing too serious where it will tear your air hole. But if you cannot deal with pressure or just like heavy earrings in general, Th these ones ain't it, baby. These ones ain't it. But the other ones, they are very, very, very hollow and thin, so you won't feel anything. But back to the fit. Y'all, like everything about this really came together so nicely and I am so happy and you guys loved it as well. Honestly, you guys, I think this one and the kimono style dress, those hold number one on the list. Like it's a tie between those two. And then the outfit where I had on this kimono comes second, but they are in my top three because I cannot put, because if I say this one's number one, then like, there's just you see what I'm doing to myself in my mind, but just know that these are my top three. But this one in particular, like, yo, everything. Now the kimonos, again, they're very thin. So you do want to be mindful of the material and not to, you know, be in any environment or be anywhere where it can snag and pull and stuff like that, because we don't want that. Um, of course, we did accessorize with gold gold heels and the gold purse. And these kimonos, they don't come with any belts or anything like that. Oh, also I did get another one. It's a shorter one. Um, that one did come with a belt though, but that one ended up becoming more so like my everyday going to the pool style kimono. 
That one is the only one that came with a belt. If you want to, you know, jazz up your look, get yourself a gold chain belt. Because back in the day, they were really on and popping, you know. And I have one from Fashion Nova, but I honestly don't remember where I put it. But when I saw this one from Zara, I'm like, nah, it's that hammered, you know, style for me. It's just beautiful. And y'all, this is the fit. And this is how it turned out. And I just love it so, so, so much. All right, you guys. So this brings me to the end of today's video, sharing with y'all all the details of the fits that I wore in April, vacation edition, Jamaica, the redo. Drop in the comments below and let me know which one is your favorite. And also I wanna put out there, um, I've been getting asked a lot about pictures. Um, let me know if you want a part two of how I take my pictures now, but all the pictures that I took in Jamaica were all taken on my Canon R, EOS R, and I have a flash attached to it because that is a camera, it's a full frame camera that does not have a built-in flash. And I find external flashes, you have more control of the power that you want it to burst out for your photos. So the external flash I have is the Canon 430 EXR T3, something like that. Like, yo, when I tell you that these brands and these numbers and names and stuff that they be giving, like, I just can't. But that is the duo picture combo that I use now to take my pictures. But if you guys want me to do a more detailed type of video showing y'all and stuff, let me know. But I don't take my pictures by myself anymore. Like, I take my pictures when I'm out when I'm with somebody, that's how I get my pictures. But if I have to, I'll still take my pictures by myself, but that's that. But anyways, that is something completely different, but drop in the comments below and let me know which one was your favorite outfit. You guys know my top three. I will have everything linked below. I'll link what I can, whatever's still available will be linked. And I think majority of everything is linked below or is still available. So I'll have it linked below. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that little bell to be notified whenever I upload a video so you never miss a video. Follow me on Instagram at Tamara Renee. That is where you will see all the looks honey. That's where you see all the looks first. Okay. Follow me on TikTok at Tamara.Renee and keep up with me on my blog at www.tamararenee.com. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Tutorial coming soon of that blue eyeshadow look. So it's coming and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.